131 Outer Drive. Outer Drive is located, that that's 41, the commercial building down there, so we're just off 41, close to uh, a little bit south of Trader Joe's. Uh, Riverwood is right over there. This is a, it's a good, nice little neighborhood that's tucked in here. This house has been all redone. It is a um, three bedroom, two bath. It's, it's pretty cool. I, I, I there's, a, there's some things I kind of like about it. Um, the first thing is that when you walk in, you have this uh, wide open kitchen and big long bar. Uh, that's actually bamboo flooring is what they used here. It's, it's very clever. I like it. It's a nice surface. Uh, the kitchen is nice. It, it, it's open. It's just for mica and they painted the cabinets, but it's, it's very cool. It looks nice. It shows well. And it's a big wide open space. Um, this is a laminate flooring that they used here. It looks nice. They must have just put it down. Uh, breaks my heart because it's over this really pretty terrazzo. This is the terrazzo that probably runs the whole house. And it's just a real pretty when you have that red in here. Probably the original kitchen. I had a kitchen. <laughs> original bathroom. The tile's in good shape. I wouldn't, I wouldn't have changed it either. This is the guest bathroom um, because there's two bedrooms here that share it. You can see the low pitch of this roof. Um, and that is, that, that is the pitch of this roof. So there's hardly any roof line there. Uh, this closet's been bumped out. They, I think they added this closet and um, trying to figure figure out how it went. Um, linen closets. And then this is the other guest bedroom. The nice thing I like about this house is the fact that there's new windows everywhere. So those windows were all replaced. All, and there's a lot of windows in here as you'll see and they're all new. The AC doesn't look new, doesn't look old. I'd have to get a date on that. Um, it looks okay. And so that's, I'm gonna give it the okay stamp. But you can see how the ceiling tilts down just a little bit right there and right over there because of the pitch of the roof is so low. Um, but I really like the, I like this layout a lot. Uh, there's a lot of windows. And then this is considered a bedroom um, because it has its own closet. I guess I'd use this as the master bedroom perhaps, but look at all these windows, which is really nice. It's a big, long room. I mean, this room is probably 20 feet long um, by 12 feet wide. Has a closet here, and then this bathroom. That's, um, I, like, I like this wood grain looking tile. It has a shower, so it has its own little bathroom here. And then this goes out to the garage. So the only thing is, uh, washer and dryer are out here, which makes this pretty tight for um, a bigger car. I, you can fit a small car, but I think it's a little tight. Um, again, you can see the, the roof line and the pitch of the roof, which is very, very shallow. Um, the ducting barely, you know, squeezes through there. And, um, you know, it's a little garage. I could have painted this floor. But all in all, I mean, there's some things I really like about this house, uh, namely is the is the layout with the kitchen. I like this. Um, I like this big, but big bedroom. I'm gonna call it a bedroom. And then the backyard has a bamboo and a fire pit and is fenced in. So it's pretty pretty cute, pretty cute house. I'm Jules Roman with Yorkshire International 941-366-0000. Thanks for watching.